18th century sources, the primary sources, get kids excited about history because you are touching it, you are part of it. You're not having it filtered through some you know, boring middle-aged professor or some teacher who is telling you the story you've heard before. You're reading it for yourself. You're experiencing it. So reporting the Revolutionary War allows students to get a first-hand account of this, to get into the real stuff of history. And the real excitement of history is finding out things that nobody else knows and discovering it for yourself. So that's really the joy of using primary sources like this, and it's really the genius of something like reporting the Revolutionary War that allows you to get a first-hand account of what's happening unfiltered by someone else. The teachers and students who have the opportunity to read uh, Reporting the Revolutionary War will be able to discover history on their own. We'll be able to get in at the moment, the moment of creation, and see what's happening and experience this world the way Paul Revere did, George Washington did, and see the world as they saw it. Yeah, it's really a chance to discover something no one else knows. By looking at these newspapers, you'll encounter this world, lots of worlds that no one else knows exist, but you do. You become the discoverer. It becomes something you then can share with others. Reporting the Revolutionary War is going to make each student his or her own historian.